First question, is it true that you love the dogs more than me? Because they've been telling me that's the, that's the truth. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually stumped on the first one. Babe, you can't hesitate on that. Well, you can't make me choose between... Me and the golden yeah. retrievers. Yeah, that's fair. All right, everyone. I love you all equally. Welcome. <laughs> yeah, we're equal. Me and the dogs. No. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I love you more. Everybody, welcome to Maddie's six-month pregnancy update. That was going to be the first question. How far along are you? How many weeks? The girls want the week number. Yeah, the weeks is 26. 26 weeks 26 along. 26 weeks. We have 14 weeks left. Okay, and these are all questions that I have gotten from the internet, thanks to my Instagram followers for <laughs> responding to my story so all right first question how did you get pregnant there's birds there's bees oh and there's you <laughs> okay all right <laughs> no, i just want to throw a funny one in all right do so we how... want to talk about where it was colorado colorado yeah the altitude it was the altitude guys <laughs> i don't know what to tell you all right when did you know you were pregnant i was at the gym yep I actually experienced higher heart rate. Yeah. I felt like I was going crazy, like I was out of breath. Started to question. Yeah, I was kind of thrown off and you know, I was coming up around that time. And so, I don't know, for peace of mind, girls, you understand, you just take a test and you're like, yeah, I'm just gonna get my period whenever. TMI, but yeah, took the test, <clears throat> found out I was pregnant. It was actually I also positive. Want to, I wanna take some credit because I can tell by your boobs, not gonna lie. Just putting it out there. He actually made me take a test. I was before, I was, Yeah. I knew before the test, I said 100%. For sure. It's actually really cool that you would know that. You know, gotta keep tight track of those puppies. Any guesses on what the baby's weight is gonna be when it comes oh out? Oh my gosh. I was 7'11 and he was 10 and a half pounds. Yep. So it's gonna be a big boy. More nine? I'm going for nine. Okay. I like it. <laughs> That's still really big. So in far in like our ultrasound projections, he's been about 10% larger than average is what we could say, right? Yeah. Okay. Fair. Does having a baby cleat affect the way you look at the dangers of racing? That I'm no. Okay, good. Because you know. No, yeah, you're We already safe. take all the safety precautions. Yeah. Most of the time. All right, what's the biggest annoyance that you've had since becoming pregnant? I really wasn't expecting food aversions. Like what is that? Food aversions, so usually you have cravings for yeah. things, and everybody's like, what are your crazy cravings? But That's I didn't awesome. have any, really, crazy. Yeah. I had more, like, in the beginning, like, I hated all food. I only wanted junk food. Yeah, but now you When it sense. came down to it, but now I'm fine. Okay, and... I don't know. I guess that's one thing. That's the next question. What are your food cravings? Right now, ice cream. Ice cream. I think that's like... Which flavor? <sighs> chocolate. Chocolate. The one I post on Instagram. Okay. Big I don't chocolate. even know what it's called. I will Fair say <laughs> that for a while, it was uh, virgin pina coladas and oh, yeah. peel and eat shrimp. We did have that craving going for a while. You can't say that you got no yeah. craving because we ate shrimp for a lot of days. <laughs> yeah, it was really nice. It was good. I can right. actually go. So for that's it. your your biggest annoyance was the food issues. What is your favorite part about being pregnant? Favorite part is feeling him kick. Okay. Feeling his clutch foot. Yeah, he's crazy. You felt him the other I know. night. Yeah, I can feel him pretty much every night. Stick his hand right underneath my belly yeah. and it's just like doing the Dougie. Yeah. At <laughs> first you can't really tell if like she's moving or if it's the baby but now we're at the point where like you can definitely feel the baby like pew 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 what are you looking forward to the most mm, i don't know why i think of this but his smell yeah i like <laughs> i can see that <laughs> i like want to smell him i don't know why that's really weird but i hear that's like a thing and i sniff the dogs all the time i know you do <laughs> 
<laughs> it's like the, it's like a puppy smell. I don't know. They still have that in their head. Yeah, that'll so. be interesting. Yeah. I'm I actually curious what he's going to smell like, too. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure he'll have, like, of course, bodily fluids going everywhere. But I have a feeling that babies have, like, this strong, loving smell. <laughs> and do you want to have this child and then have another? Or do you want to have this child wait till he's out of diapers? What's your thoughts? At first, I thought that it would be good to just have one after the other. Yeah. I don't know. I think we're going to wait. Especially because it's coming down to the final few months and I'm yeah. a little nervous. Maybe let, let your body yeah. reconfigure. Okay. All right. A year or two. I don't know. We haven't really Whatever talked about works. It. Yeah. Whatever works. Okay. Well, that's pretty much all the questions I have. I know you had some. <laughs> Switching roles here. All right, let's see. All right. What is the first Christmas gift that you are going to purchase for him? Oof. Do you need to be in the seat? No, can you're good. You? I'm definitely going to get one of those little um, cars that they can drive, but you can also control it with an RC controller because I know he's not going to be able to drive it right away. Right. So I'll show him what he needs to do. Like what you got Oakland. Yes. Yeah, so <laughs> I, I bought. I got one for James' daughter. That was really cool. All right. Down the road, first car. Oof. You're gonna Probably start him really low, aren't so, you? So man, when like he's, an S10. When he's sixteen, he'll be what year will that be? Twenty thirty eight. Oh my god. So <laughs> terrible man i mean probably like a c6 man a c7 corvette would be like theoretically old and cheap by then so probably a corvette c7 i would think do you have an idea of what parenting style you'll choose this one might be hard i don't really know the names of all the styles but i'm gonna try and raise them the way i was raised do you think Work you're gonna be good what you want yeah. that's a good idea do you think you're gonna be good cop or bad cop like, are you gonna be like Ooh. stern? <laughs> well, I know with the dogs, I'm bad cop, so I'm, I imagine that'll carry over, cause you're such a pushover. I like them in the bed; they're so cute. Okay, what are you gonna do when the baby starts crying? Get up and bring it to you. <laughs> I knew you were gonna say. <laughs> what am that? I supposed to do? Well, I can't breastfeed. <laughs> You think that the answer is only breastfeeding? I think for a while it is. True. You, there's like steps. Not that I would know. I just imagine we'll there's steps. We'll figure it out. Maybe a car ride. How will you come for me during labor? Uh, You're there. <laughs> You're I doing will great. Softly pet you and say, "Great job." Oh. Now I'll hold your I'll hold your paw. Imagine. And tell you, it being encouraging like, things okay that's good it's 14 hours at least i mean maybe right some girls are like going there and boom we'll see <sighs> i'll be there with you i'm just preparing for like 24 hours of sheer pain we'll see it's all right it's just a blimp in the whole world yeah in our whole lives exactly yeah with the history of your like farming lifestyle in nebraska what are you going to bring back, like bring to his life? Oh, that would absolutely. be like the same. Like, what would you like? I think the responsibility of having, you know, some animals. Dogs is definitely one thing, but like, you know, maybe we get some chickens because those are really fun when you're kids. Chickens mm -hmm. are so entertaining. Ducks. I've been wanting some ducks. Ducks. Yeah, That's I think dunk. I would bring in some of that stuff. Obviously, mowing was a huge part of my childhood. Definitely going to make him mow. I mean free mowing that's basically what i'm in this whole deal for <laughs> yeah it's the only reason why you would have yeah. a kid <laughs> get out of our interview and you go, hey oh they're sniffing around um were you scared in the beginning yeah when actually i told I you was. And we even like agreed we both wanted to get pregnant soon and uh it happened sooner than we thought, and it was scary. 100% was really scary. Like, I was all gung-ho until it actually happened, and then we were like, holy crap, what have we done? Shit is getting real. Yeah. <laughs> Are you scared now? No. No. I just want him to be healthy. How will you balance work and new family life? 
I don't know, you know, I don't leave as much. I'm not gone for as long as I used to be. There's yeah. just May and June are tough because I'm gone so much then with race week and the month of freedom. But we're able to make so much content locally that I think we'll transition to more local content and then I'll be able to be around more. And now that I don't live so far from work, you know, we were home so much earlier. So even though everyone thinks we're super busy, like we're not that busy, I don't think. We could definitely be way busier. Yeah. So I'm not really worried about it. Final question. How do you feel now that we're 14 weeks away? I'm excited for him to be here. If he could be here tomorrow, I would say yes. I know, you're like so prepared. You're like, <laughs> what was it? It was th the third month? Yeah, I was and like, you're I like, I'm ready. Here. I'm so, like, whoa. Here's the problem. When, you're, when your wife is pregnant, they sit around and overthink and plan so much that it's just one of those things that if the baby was here... I think that your mothering skills that you already have are going to just kick in and, like, everything's going to be fine. Yeah. So. I'm really hoping it, like, kicks in. Cause yeah. It's going to. Look at what you, how good of a job you do taking care of us. <laughs> when the baby's here, it's going to be all. Awesome. Yeah. So. I'll figure it out. All right. Well, this was our six-month update. We'll probably do an update for the next several months till the baby's here. So drop your guys' comments in the comments below ask us questions and we'll try and answer them to the best of our abilities on the next episode of leader and maddie talk about bump dates bump dates <laughs> bump updates thanks <laughs>